Hello, hello, hello YouTube and welcome to another Charisma Tool Tutorial. Today I am going to take a look at the camera tool. What does it do? How do you use it? Let's get started. Well, basically um, what the camera does is that uh, you can spawn it and then you can look at yourself or at a prop or whatever um, for any reason. Up here, like any other um, tool that needs a setting or some key to activate it, uh, that's what you do. You just kind of click it and... Uh, I have set it to numpad number zero because I like that. Um, and you just spawn it by left clicking, spawning it, and then I press the numpad zero, and well, there I am. Um, if you have, well, you might wonder what these hats are. It's a mod called Pack Editor. You can go ahead and check that out in the workshop if you want to. It allows you to put on props on your playing well that follows you. It's pretty cool. Okay. Let's move on. Um, so there's this option called Static Camera. The description says makes the camera unmovable. Well, that's basically what it means. Now that it's unchecked, you see I can move the camera with my fizz gun. But if I check this and spawn another camera, it's static. I mean, I cannot move it or hit it or anything. Nothing will happen to it. Um, so that's basically what that does. Um, I never use it though, because um, usually I'll just weld my camera to something and then it will work. Uh, toggle, well like all the other toggles and the other, all the tools, uh, basically now I am just clicking it once, it stays on, if I uncheck this, I have to keep holding it in order to me to see myself. Anyway, so, um, another function I want to point out is that if you right click and click on the ground, it will follow your player. See, wherever, wherever I go, it will follow my player. This is pretty useful if you want to see yourself in a car or, you know, whatever. It will follow your player model. You can also make the prop follow a... No, 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 wait, sorry. Make the camera follow a prop if you right-click on the prop. See, it will follow the prop like that. Um, I don't know why you would do that, but see, this is how it works. Pretty cool. Uh, that is it. If you have any questions, please leave a comment. If you guys wonder what map I'm playing on, it's called GM underscore Big City in one word. Um, I will have a, and the name will be in the description, so just go ahead and search for that on the, on the Steam Workshop. It's pretty easy to find, so uh, that shouldn't be a problem. So, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.